Capri. I know you're upset, but you've got to eat. I'm just so mad at myself. I should have realized that the maternal instinct is so strong that even Danielle would develop it. <laughs> What's so funny? You know those animals who eat their young? Even they have more maternal instinct than Danielle. Then why would she want the child? You've known her how long and you still haven't figured out how that lintel she calls a brain works? There's no need to insult your sister. Let him talk. All right. Danielle cares about three things. Danielle, fun, and, uh... Wait, I was wrong. It's just two. And a retirement village is fun? Compared to what you're offering her. A crappy job and community college. I mean, you think Grandma's gonna make her do any of that? So Danielle's only doing this because Phyllis is offering her a cushy life? Yep. Yeah. If you want that baby, you're gonna have to outbid Grandma. What are you doing here? Hi, John. I wanted to talk to you. It'll be very friendly. No hitting. What's up? This is gonna sound weird, but uh, I've been doing some thinking lately. And, well, I've decided that it's time for me to forgive you. For sleeping with my wife. You know, I didn't just sleep with Gabby. I fell in love with her. I forgive you for that, too. Why are you doing this? You in some kind of 12-step program? Let's just say I've recently learned how loving someone makes you forget the difference between right and wrong. Anyway, that's pretty much it. I should go. Hey. You still talk to Gabrielle? Occasionally. Why? I just wanted to know if she was happy. I think she is. Well, good for her. <laughs> 